Asterix was launched on November 26, 1965 from the CIESS facility in Hamagur, Algeria. Its goal was to be the first French satellite, and it was launched on the first French satellite launch vehicle, the Diamant A. Diamant means diamond in French, and it came out of the Gemstones program, in which its prototype predecessors were the Agate, Topaz, Emerald, Ruby, and Sapphire, of which Emerald and Topaz became the first and second stages of the Diamant, respectively. This was the first orbital launch attempt for the Diamant, and it turned out to be successful, making France the third country, after the Soviet Union and the United States, to launch a satellite into space on its own rocket. France was the sixth country to have a satellite in orbit, after the Soviet Union, the United States, the United Kingdom's Area 1 on Thor Delta, Canada's Alouette 1 on Thor Agena, and Italy with San Marco 1 on a scout rocket in 1964. Like the other satellites, Asterix was as light as possible, coming in at 42 kilograms. The Diamant rocket had a launch pad mass of 18.4 tons and featured a unique first stage, the Vexen engine, which burned turpentine and nitric acid for a horrendous surface-specific impulse of 203 seconds. The stage also featured fin-tip verniers for control. It was followed by a solid stage, the Topaz, which had four nozzles, and a final Apogee kick stage to complete orbit. Diamant A was launched four times with three successes, and was followed by the Diamant B and Diamant BP4, which both launched from Kourou, where the European Space Agency continues to launch rockets to this day. The Vexen engine on Diamant was converted to use the UDMH and N204 to improve efficiency, and found itself on the second stage of the Europa launch vehicle, the product of the ELDO, the precursor to the current European Space Agency. With that, thank you for watching this mission profile of Asterix.